Right. Now, Hodia is here in studio. As I mentioned earlier, um, self-taught uh, chef has been doing so much. Trust me, uh, through her Instagram page, she's grown her business and she calls herself foodpreneur. And you want to talk about her journey because at the end of the day, uh, looking at young people, how you have this uh, passion and talent, but you don't really utilize it. And she's here with me in studio. We'll be talking about her journey, how she started. And trust me right now, she's supplying food to so many people around Nairobi. And this is an amazing story. Good morning. Good morning. And sorry about the traffic. <laughs> Today has been hectic for people in here. Nairobi is yeah, in yeah, Nairobi. Nairobi. Nairobi is in difficult. Nairobi. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, how are you doing? I'm good, you? Uh, I'm very good. Uh, I, I must say, uh, trying to look at your story uh, as a self-taught chef. Uh, maybe, you know, you know, it's, it's kind of mind-boggling, but by the time say self-taught chef yeah. who was your teacher how did you learn <laughs> like it's it's crazy so tell us your story how was it how did you start actually it all started as a passion okay just at home okay um yeah i just loved cooking okay then now uh, friends kept telling me hey you should get serious with this thing okay make it your thing mm -hmm. at that time i was employed mm -hmm. Uh, that was actually my first and last job. Wow. Okay. Yes. So one day I just quit my job. Interesting. Yes. Okay. I was not happy with what I was doing and I wanted mm -hmm. to do something I actually love. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And first started off selling, you know, the, 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 the road from KU to Kahawa and Dani. Okay. okay. Students yes, stay in Kahawa and Dani. Yeah, yes. Yeah, yeah. So I first started selling smokies. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what is it called? Maini yeah, gizzard yeah. Wow. along okay. the way. Okay. Yeah, so I grew, I grew, I grew. After mm -hmm. a while, I opened a pork joint mm -hmm. with someone mm -hmm. with selling fries too. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Then somehow that didn't work out. Okay. I took a break mm -hmm. to think about how I want to do this again. Okay. Okay. And then now I came up with the meal prep idea. Wow, okay. <coughs> so meal prep is basically what, where I used to go to a client's place. Okay. I make your food for like a week uh -huh. and put it in the fridge. Okay. Wow. Yeah. Okay. So it all started like that. Uh -huh. It grew, it grew, it grew. And uh -huh. then I ilifika a point. Uh -huh. People now want food. Yeah. yeah. Like yeah. delivered to them. To them, yeah. So I was at first scared. Uh -huh. And then I talked to my mentor. She was like, you do this, Bana. If, uh -huh. If you think it's something that could work and people mm -hmm. want it, try. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. pole pole, mm -hmm. I can get here gas, mm -hmm. sufuria, nini, I yeah. started. Wow, okay. Naivo tundio ili kick off. Wow, that's interesting. Yeah. Now, um, you know, not everyone knows how to cook, eh? trust yeah. me. Not everyone <laughs> knows how to cook. Like, it's, it's crazy. But the time someone tells you, mm -hmm. I can cook, I'm a mm -hmm. chef. Mm -hmm. Then you go, you try their food, goodness. Just a different taste. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, um, how did you now, you know, the self finesse? The feelings of tasty food. Yes. Some food actually they look so nice, but when you taste, just pathetic. Yeah, maybe yeah. too tangy, too yeah, sweet. Yeah, yeah. It's just the the tactical of balancing your ingredients, your everything. Now, how was the process of learning? More of YouTube, Facebook. There's this Facebook page actually. It okay. was awarded. It's called Let's Cook Kenyan Meals. Okay. It has about more than a million followers. Okay. So yeah, you get recipes there, try them out. Sometimes they backfire. You just throw everything and try to kill that smell in the house. Okay, okay. <laughs> but but, but, but look, 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 looking at also um, the photos right there. Um, yeah. There's a way you package your dish. Yes. Yeah, and which is kind of very unique. Uh, mm -hmm. I can look uh, directly over there. And uh, this one, basically, like the ones, this is Gomingi, this is a supply. Yeah, this yeah, so, one is a supply. supply. Yes. So, um, offices maybe schools mm -hmm. how do you now expand on this because at the end of the day you started small but yes. here you are and you see the, the thing with even starting small you mm -hmm. get scared of growing yeah, yeah. you get it scary mm -hmm. what if i do this it doesn't work out yeah. so um like office officers when they request lunch yeah. i i take their menu say for example today switch tv mm -hmm. we want lunch yeah. you tell me this is what we want for lunch yeah. i will post that is what i'm making for lunch what's called what, what bones huh? <laughs> so <laughs> anyway yeah, yeah sure. so i deliver it to you okay when I post, when you tell me what you want, say you want pilau and chicken, I'll yeah. post I'm making pilau and chicken ah, so that okay. other orders merge oh, with your order. Absolutely. You absolutely. see? Yeah. So I'll deliver to you mm -hmm. and now deliver the rest. Uh -huh. And uh -huh. and for me to deliver, it has uh -huh. come with the 
help and cooperation of okay this is just border border people you see yeah, they mean yeah. heaven to me um, i can imagine you see that that promptness. Many letter. Yeah. yes wow. bio, bio. so i got yeah. a car a car basket yeah i just put it there and send the pin locations to him okay, okay. and tell him this is the first client mm -hmm. she's taking two containers this okay. is the second oh. one that just like wow, that interesting yeah. okay. so this guy mm -hmm. has to be chap -chap. very chapter yeah. by the yeah. way now do you have a nutritional plan for example a week you know you could just cook anything yeah the people want a balanced diet yes um monday this tuesday that yes. uh, how do you do that I, uh, okay, since for now I'm cooking from home before uh -huh. I expand, of yeah. course there are plans and everything, yeah. I'll write the menu okay. so that mm -hmm. if, say, an office calls and asks what's for lunch tomorrow, I'll give them yeah. that and that yeah. is what I'll also tell my clients yes. so that the orders merge. But with mm -hmm. time, of course, I want to give people variety. Yeah. And there are also those people who want to eat healthy. Mm -hmm. I also mm -hmm. sort them mm -hmm. out, mm -hmm. come okay. up with healthy meal plans. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So basically, Morning, I deal with lunch. Afternoon, I did deal with the wow. clients who have, wow. like, say, nutritional problems and yeah, all that. Yeah, yeah. So, oh, yes. so we have such? Yes. Okay. People who don't eat carbs, people by who don't way, eat way, yeah. white meat, uh -huh. red meat, people who don't eat gluten. Wow. We have all kinds of problems. Diabetic people. Yeah, yes, true that. Interesting. Mm -hmm. All right, we'll take a short break. When you come back now, she'll be telling us about her challenges. You know, at the end of the day, uh, she's doing this alone and uh, she has uh, plans to expand. So she'll be telling us more about her expansion plans. Also, the fact that she's a young lady, trust me, there's so many things that can distract her progress. So all are coming to you after a short break. Stay tuned to Morning Life. Welcome back to Morning Live. Yes, Hodia kind of worked out. She was going just to, to kind of uh, just uh, sort out uh, her, her makeup. And then now when you go on with this conversation, um, there's that uh, aspect of, you know, at the end of the day, you've been cooking for all this time. And, you know, you went to school. Your parents took you to school to study something. But your passion has led you to cooking. And you're doing it so well. And there's another challenge also whereby, because you've started cooking, there's that quality mark which you don't want to pass to another person. So that means no one can help you cook and guys are used to your food. Now looking at all these explanations, uh, you start with school. Mm -hmm. You went to school? Yes. Now you're doing this? So how are your parents' reaction? I'm sure they're watching right now. She's <laughs> watching right now. My mom, first of all, when I told when I started this thing, she thought it was a side hustle. Okay. So I call she done now. Yeah, yeah. Then she noticed every time she tells me, Mom, Ni mwangas jina nani? Akupe kazi mpata na I tell her, sir, okay. I don't call the person. Okay. I don't make efforts. Mm -hmm. I don't even try to lie that I got late yeah, or something. Yeah, yeah. So one time I just told her, Mom, unajua nini? Mm -hmm. I actually don't want to be employed. She was like, oh, you want to do that thing like full time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, see, nini? I told yeah, her, yes. Yeah. And from that time, I didn't support to. Wow, wow. Once she calls me, Mom, ni mekutumia apron. Mom, wow. me wow. table, ma. That's good. That's me good. Me amboga, so which is good. Yeah. So, apo pati ya baba tuta. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, so for another day. <laughs> okay. Now, looking at the support system, your mom is here. Mm -hmm. supported you big time. Mm -hmm. Um, y you know, there's that aspect of even uh, the young people who most of them are watching right now. Sometimes mm -hmm. we really cry for all of unemployment. Yeah. Um, you know how to cook. <laughs> you self-taught. Are you doing it so well because it's your talent and it's also a passion. Now, um, when you talk about statistics of unemployment in this country, always now it's just it's just just it's it's not good. That's Doesn't not even know. Even good, yeah. yeah. So, um, what's your what's your advice? Because now, as the Oraro I mean, director is really rolling what you've cooked. Eh? Mm -hmm. What's your advice um, on these people who are still trying to make ends meet? They've gone to school, then knocking in all these offices with their papers, but nothing is coming back. What's your advice? I want to challenge these people. Yeah. Hmm? Try to, you see the same way looking for a job. Yeah. Try to be the person to help someone through mm. that. Yeah. yeah. Like create that opportunity. Now, youth, when you are not here, there is no kupata capital, ningumunini. Start your passion mm -hmm. as a service. Yeah. You get? Kama mm mimi, -hmm. nilianza kupikia watu. I needed no capital, fair yeah. too. Yeah. Na fair, sasino, unacheza yeah. na client TV, anakutumia yeah. down payment. It's true. So, for example, you love 
washing yeah. kush fulia tu ngo by the yo sikazi ya madharau you mm -hmm. can actually make good money from that yeah. kama you know that is what you like you can't afford the washing machine start by kuosha watu kwao mm -hmm. with time mm -hmm. start even getting watu wanaenda wenyewe kufua yeah. unawavalisha yeah. uniform they yeah. look so professional mm -hmm. trust me ato kiambia client kukuoshe easy, easy ngo handful thao yeah. atakubali yeah. because of yeah. the way you've presented your yeah. business yeah. start true. from there pole pole buy your first washing machine mm -hmm. second thing get a place and that's how you grow mm -hmm. if you have a passion and don't have the capital start it as a service mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. then grow from there okay ukilielea story yeah. capital no one yeah. will one day come and just tell you shika Anza, yeah, true, you get, and you, you see when you start small, mm -hmm. you see the problems and you know how to tackle them. Yeah, By the time of yeah. Ikea Juma Anza place yako, mm -hmm. you're somehow good. Mm -hmm. You'll not incur more losses than ile tu mm -hmm. umeanza. Yeah, uh, absolutely. You see, yeah, that yeah. could work. So, now ile food we share make a customer, wow, is this me? Niseme tu kweli, kulikuwa na indomi challenge, I think two weeks back. I made that food, sikuwa na mini ni mini meunda. You know, the guy who was coming to test, to, 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 kutest your food, alikula, liona reaction yake, yanko like, okay, that was me. Na nile vitu tu na batisha. In fact, ato yo sikuwa ni me pre-cook, like kujaribu kwanza. That was the best. Wow, interesting. Now let's talk about quantity. You know, quantity and quality go the same direction. Trust me. Mm. When the food is small, it is okay poor. Mm. But if you're mingi, there's a challenge. How do you manage this? Because now, so many people, you know very well, uh, some weddings kind of backfire, some mm -hmm. funerals also food backfire. But you know, I'm from Western Kenya, and mm. trust me, people, uko, uko watu, dish is very important, by the way. And trust me, when it backfires, if atakani matanga even arusi wa mekuja, they can't complain to you. Ichumve yiko kwa ichakula. So, maybe you can tell us more about it. Because quality and quantity, how do you manage this? On quantity, this is how I do it. I don't use very big sufuriyas. See, even if you give me an order for 80 people, I'll use sufuriyas. To say me 40, 40, not one. So I do the 40, 40, either combine kama ni stew, ama kama ni rice, siko tu hivo kando. Then quality is what I don't even compromise yeah, on. Lio mana sa zingine, mtu wakikwambia maybe anataka food ya handed bobi, uh -huh. politely decline and say, yeah. I was yeah. the because yeah, so. <laughs> first of all, zile vitu natumia kwen yeah, shoko na food poor. Mm -hmm. You see, quality, like for example, if you're using cheese, you don't just use any, you yeah. use the best brand. Yeah. Say coconut milk, the best brand. So no, no. Mm -hmm. So for, for quality, you also have to put a limit for yourself in terms of pricing. Like, so this is it, and that's in here, mm -hmm. because it will make me yeah. compromise on yeah. what I will use. Yeah. Yeah. So I'd rather re maintain my quality mm -hmm. at a certain price. Dio, kila mtu afurai. Looking at the freshness, mm -hmm. um, have you realized people prefer kibandaski? than even like these big hotels because now if food the cycle it mm. flows mm. that means tomorrow there'll be fresh food how do you manage to keep your food fresh because at the end of the day um you don't you don't work with around maybe 100 bob or something like that but still mm. it's mm -hmm. closer there not yeah. so far from 100 yes, bob yes. but still how do you manage to keep your food fresh in in actually high uh, uh, quantities case scenario if i post tomorrow and make biryani uh -huh. by the time i sleep i have say 20 orders. Wow. Nikia okay. mka, mm -hmm. nipate zimefika 30. Yeah. Sita, sita jichocha nipike ya 50. Yeah. yeah. Nitapika ya 35 hapo mm -hmm. because I know in between the time I'm cooking to mm -hmm. the time I'm delivering, yeah. kuna watu wata call call. And of course sometimes it gets crazy like nisha seti food, mm -hmm. I get like 20 calls. We want food, we want yeah, food. Yeah, so unawana? Yeah. yeah. Inabidi tu, I'd rather give you a no than give you give food that is not you. fresh. Yeah, so yeah. napenda tu when I cook, mm. yote imenda. Yeah. Sometimes yeah. even ata misi baki na food. Manze wow. na pikezo mautamu, then yeah, I go eat. You, you go. Serious? <laughs> yes. Wow. Okay, interesting. <laughs> Ama naenda <laughs> kibanda. <laughs> okay, interesting. Now, um, the angle of where um, one day you want to expand. Of course, you've mentioned you're opening one soon. Yes. Right now, you're cooking from the house. Mm -hmm. But now, look <laughs> at this. You need someone to help you cook. That means the orders will be more and more. That is the most scary thing. Yes. See, thing is, in your shidai kitu, mm -hmm. it's a craft that you have it, and sadly you can't get someone to do the exact same job. Yeah. You get. Mm -hmm. You hire someone, they look okay day one, day two, day three, mm -hmm. day four, hapo anakuangusha kidogo, yeah, sazina yeah. na mm -hmm. choma picha paka kamera ina, <laughs> inabidi client to be mrudishia pesa wow. yake. So wow. it's very tricky. Okay. 
Have you experienced that? Have you given someone responsibility to do it and then you maybe you're away? Yes, yeah. yes, yes. Okay. And some, in a, I feel so bad because it's the brand name that yeah, gets yeah, destroyed. Yeah, you true, see, and true. you have to apologize, make yeah. it up to your client, sometimes make a refund. Mm -hmm. And probably this person will not understand because Alifanya Kazi. Yeah. Anataka kulipwa. Yeah, you true. are telling them you it's want true. to refund. It's true. It can cause you so much trouble. When the one you up is you, Lipangi, you are sana. But okay. I've had mm -hmm. one person on board since I began, okay. and so far he's. He? Yes. A he. A wow. he. So a young guy is actually 19. We can cook, actually. So, it was a man who can cook. Yeah, yes. <laughs> uh, anyway, um, uh, George Raro, uh, my director, says he cooks, but I know he's an omupishi. You know, so let's not even go there. But now, um, you have your Instagram page. It really helps you. That's, that's you. That's, yeah, yeah. I just Instagram, Instagram every night. You're using like, Instagram to sell your food. Yeah. Imagine. Yeah. How do you do it now? Of course, you post so many pictures, as mm. you've seen right here. Yeah. Actually, we took those pictures from Instagram. You Interesting. Stole. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we took. <laughs> 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 now, uh, <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, from Instagram, how do you manage to now um, get your clients? Of course, uh, we saw a message, mm -hmm. a phone, email address, everything. How yes. do you do it now? Mostly the clients just DM me. Hi, mm -hmm. I mm -hmm. have a party. I want you to cook for me. Hi, yeah, yeah. we want you to deliver lunch to our mm -hmm. office. Mm -hmm. Instagram and Saidia, by the yeah, way. Yeah, it's true. The way I mm -hmm. see some people abusing it, I'm like... Yeah, yeah. People, anyway, people, yes. people posting funny photos with the Bible scriptures. Interesting. <laughs> anyway, so uh, as you're winding up, uh, mm -hmm. uh, of course you've mentioned uh, the young people who can start from na uh, yes, nothing. Yes, please. I want people yeah. to do that so much. Mm -hmm. I, I feel so good when someone asks me, what do you think I can do? How do I start this? Mm -hmm. Rather than, niandike mm kazi. -hmm. You get yeah, And then yeah, you know, yeah, another yeah. thing that really puts me off with the youth, they'll cry, cry, hakuna jobs, hakuna nini. But unapata Mtu ni best yeah, yeah, mm? yeah. They know very well ni kona opportunity na uh -huh. deliver. Yeah. I need groceries sometimes. Uh -huh. I need a helper even yeah, to help me do this. Yeah. But mtu hata hai kuambia. Yeah. But every day, chep, uh -huh. kazi. Yeah. Chep, hakuna kazi. Chep, yeah. life ni hard. But yeah. even yeah. this, you see... You see, when you see these small opportunities and follow them up, ata mungu wana kubariki, ata mungu wana kufungulia njia. But when you ignore them and you're crying there, you want to be employed, you want a white office uh -huh. job, it's almost next to impossible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no. Oh, yeah, yeah. Baby steps. Okay. Now, finally, um, your food, your package, then now, how much do you sell your food? From... 300. From 300 bob. Mm. Okay. Now, someone wants to uh, reach you. Uh, mm -hmm. Today, they want you to deliver lunch. It's a, it's a Monday morning. It's 7.30 right now. Uh, they want you to deliver lunch today. So, mm -hmm. uh, for example, uh, they call you, so, uh, Shep, um, we need like around um, 50 people. How will you, it's, it's a crash program. Mm -hmm. By one, they want their food. Uh, <laughs> and you do it, eh? Yeah. Okay. You see, Kaba kuna kitume nsaidia, yeah. I've put in sync my mm. mama mboga, uh -huh. my butchery person, uh -huh. my boda boda. Like wow, it's a wow, whole nice wow. connection. Yeah, you get? Yeah, yeah. So if you give me that mm. last minute call, mm. I call him, butchery, mama mboga, okay. boda guy. Right. Pick this, this, okay. this come here. Okay. It's already done. Okay. You didn't carry any for the crew? The samples just to test? <laughs> anyway, so how can they get you on uh, the Instagram? <laughs> Chepchikoni. Chepchikoni. Yes. Wow. Chepchikoni, okay. Facebook, Instagram, mm -hmm. Twitter. Okay. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you. Really appreciate your, Next time your effort. Be no problem. <laughs> uh, learning machine, but uh, <laughs> thank you so much for coming. Thank and all you. the best with you. doing a good job. Okay. Let's take a short break right here at Morning Live. When we come back, more interesting conversations about the goodness. So stay tuned to Morning Live.